You've reached our bank. How, how may I help you today? Hello, can I speak Hello? to? Hello, can I speak to a manager, please? Yeah. Uh, well, hold on one second. Actually, let me take one second. Is this Ray? Hello? 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 Is this the manager? Hi, how can I help you? Oh, uh, is this the manager? Yeah. Okay, I walked into your shop about a couple of hours ago, right? So I asked for uh, coffee, right? And um, so after that, I picked up the coffee, I went home, I was sat in my office, right? I was watching TV for a little bit. And then I look at the coffee labels, and I was just looking at the labels and everything, and the cup said Osama. So, what can I do? Said, uh, said what? Osama. Um, Hello? yes, sir. So, w what do I do here? Do I go to CNN and tell everybody how Starbucks called me Osama just because I was Muslim? You got that from, from this location, sir? Yes, this location. Hello? I... Hello? Yes, go ahead. I'm sorry. I think I'm having bad reception and I'm not hearing you. Really? I'm so sorry. I think my, it's my phone. Um, so somebody wrote Osama on your cup? Yes. Well, you said you have bad reception. Do you have like the... Pop Tart 3.0. Hello. Hello. Uh, so come on, what what do I do? I'm sorry, sir. Is there any way I could take down the the phone number you're contacting me from, and I could call you right back on the other line we have at the store? What What, what are you talking about? Man. Well, I know you can hear. My, be, my, honest. be honest. My Just phone is. I'm sorry, sir. My phone is cutting out. Is there any way I could call you back from the other line we have at the store? So no, I'm trying to talk right now. I'm busy. I, I'm on my other phone. No, I no. I'm asking if I can contact you on my store's other phone. Hello? Hello? Oh, my God. She's acting like she doesn't hear me, man. Hello? Sir? Yes. You know you can hear me. Be honest. May so, I please call you back on my no, store's I other line? Talk, no. I'm having a really hard time hearing you. Where did I call? Where did you pick this up from? Excuse me? Where did you pick this up from? Where's the phone at? Go outside. Maybe you can hear me better. Do you got like the pop truck? 3.0, you know, my cousin got that, and he said it's really shitty reception. Hello? Yes, sir. So, can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you better now. Okay, this is not Verizon Wireless, you know, how <laughs> can you hear me now? Alright, so what can I do? Okay, sir, so, explain to me what happened. You came to my store a few hours ago, did you come through drive through no, I came through the front. So I asked for a frappuccino, right? I sit down, away from my frappuccino. This lady says, here you go. I take it. I go home, go into my office. I was on the computer and I said, man, this is getting boring. You know, I was watching some porn, but it got boring. So I went on to the TV and I started watching and I was like, wow, this is good frappuccino, right? So I look at the cup and it said Osama. I lift up the cup and at the bottom it said Osama. And the woman in the front, she asked me, are you Muslim? And she said, yes. I said yes, and she said, what's your name? I said, Mohammed. And that's when she was like, that's a nice name. And I was like, yeah, it is. So I went home, I look at the cup, and it says Osama. So what can I do? Do I call CNN? Do I call Fox News? What? I'm very sorry, sir. I don't know of... I would certainly not condone one of my employees writing something like that on your cup. Of course not. I mean... So you're saying what? We respect, so you're we respect diversity and all of our customers here at Starbucks, and we have a non-discrimination policy. Oh, so, oh, so and do you happen to know the name of the employee who took care of you? No, because I don't ask for employees' names now. You know, I don't walk into a store. What's your name, man? What's your name? You know, I don't do that. So, like, so what saying, can I do saying, to recover this boy, for on. you? You're saying sh they didn't do it? You're saying, like, there's a paranormal activity for that's going to come out and saying, like, writing on people's cuffs or what?
You're saying a ghost did it? No, sir. I'm, I'm simply stating that we have a non-discrimination policy, and I'm extremely sorry. And I, of course, would never, never condone one of my employees writing something like that, ever. I, I'm in shock, and I'm embarrassed, and I, I feel horrible. Is there... What can I do to fix this situation and make it right for you? I don't know what I'm going to do. I just wanted to call you guys first and what, you know, there's a hate crime, right? You can, you know what that is, right? I'll go into the store and I'll find out who did it. And then I'm going to pull them out and sue them. So is that all right? I'm sorry, you're coming back here? Yes, I'm coming back. I'm suing the whole shop. You know, because everybody in America needs money, you know. So I might as well do it. I'm not sure what you're getting at, sir. I don't know how so do I to call help CNN? you if you don't tell me what you need. Right. So I need a refund or something? You, you think I'm going to be called right. Osama and then I'm going to renew a refund or something? What you expect? What can I do to make this right for you? Can I get... No, actually, I don't want nothing. I just want like 20 cups of... Uh, just like 200 cups of coffee. That's it. Is that all right? I'd be happy to offer you a beverage remake or a, re a recovery certificate so that you may <laughs> go to any Starbucks hold and on. get hold any on, beverage of your choice for free. Oh, hold on. You think I'm going to be called Osama and I'm going to want free coffee? Is that what you think I want? Well, sir, I don't know how long to solve this problem. I can recover your drink. I can give you a certificate that will allow you... A free beverage at any Starbucks if, if you don't want to come back to mine, if only to pick it up. Um. Um. Well, you know what makes things really better, right? Can I get a hand job? Excuse me? Can I get a hand job? You know what? Yes. No, and you may never, ever, ever talk to me or one of my employees that way again. I don't owe you anything, sir, and I do not believe that you were mistreated at my store anymore. Yes, you have I was. a great day. No, I'm going to call CNN now. I'm, I'm going to call CNN. Is that what you want? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Damn. Go back and see you hanged up on me. Now I'm going to drop bombs on your house. Go back. No, bro, that's a threat. No, I can't be doing that. She probably going to call the cops and then, you know, no. Because it's a bomb threat. And then they're going to take that. Yeah.